I'm literally like, what? And like, I'm saying everything. I was like, this is so drunk. It's Harriet Scott, it's Ronan Keating, and we are playing Memory Lane with Charlene Spiteri. <laughs> so, for those of you that don't know, we take out a bunch of photos from the past, and we, we'll take a trip down Memory Lane with Charlene. Exhibit number one. Exhibit number one, yeah, I'm looking at this. I'm not kidding you. He looks literally, so he's a, this is the guys from Radiohead, but he looks like he's got his hand in my back and I'm a glove puppet. <laughs> and then yeah. he's just like, I'm going like this. How tall know. is he? Oh, he's gigantic. Is he? Yeah, he's gigantic. He's like really tall. I mean, I'm not the tallest of people, but... Oh, you're yeah. tall. You're tall enough. <laughs> I know. Brilliant. I that love was this. when we were getting at Ivor Novello. Very good. Which is a songwriting award. Which, which song is the was best that? award? Go on. Yeah. We, got it for, we got it for a body of work, which oh, was great. Nice. And I remember because we were up for two of them. And, um, we were up for um, most played single or something as well. Like, it was back when they had different mm. sections. But um, I remember, like, his Sting was up for it with the one that he'd done with Puff Daddy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, Missing yeah. You or whatever yeah. that one was um, with the, the sample from um, The Police. And I remember, literally, I was I joked as he was walking past because he won it and I went like that. You've got enough Ivers. Look, yeah, let somebody yeah. else have won it. And he was such a bad mood with me. I was like, what? oh, whatever. Oh, no. Yeah, so, yeah, that, I remember that mostly the day. Nobody yes. likes grumpy people. My question was just going to be, what's, 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 the, um, what's the best award to win, it, you know? The best award to win, keep yeah. selling records. Yeah. That's the best award yeah, to yeah. win, yeah. yeah. I don't really care about awards. I just, <laughs> I don't, I've never really had any, we, you know, as a band, we've never really had a lot of um, awards to be saying, oh, you're so wonderful and did 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 we're wonderful, we love you, you're wonderful. Yeah. Nah. All enough. right, moving on to article number two. Article number two, me and my pal John, John Method Man, better known as Method Man, and um, this is us at the Brit Awards. Um, never had a Brit Award. But we performed this in, I think it was 98. I think it would have been 98, doesn't 98, it say? was it? 98, yeah. That was us, um, Say What You Want. We did a version of Say What You Want with the Wu-Tang Clan. Yeah, I was and, there. Um, I think we performed on that one too I in 98. Did play, yeah. I think you did. And it was like everybody, Spice Girls, with yeah. everybody was there. Yeah. But um, yeah, we did this and we had just literally made this record. And I remember getting summoned by the Brits and um, I'd literally just flown back from New York after making the record and they said, we want you to, we're known for our duets and we want you to sing with Smokey Robinson. And my heart went, oh my God, I'm going to sing with Smokey Robinson. And then I, I, the words came out my mouth and I went, actually, we've just made a record with the Wu-Tang Clan and probably that would be better because people are going to expect me to sing yeah. with a soul singer. Mm. Mm. Um, and this record's insane. You should literally hear this and um, we can get you the Wu-Tang Clan. And that's how it ended up. I love that. But everybody, when we walked on the stage that night, everybody went, what? And the earth, because nobody knew we'd done it yet. Yeah, yeah. That's brilliant. And then the Huge. record hit them that day. Yeah, I love that. Yeah. Brilliant. Um, I love this next picture. There seems to be a story. I would love to know what's going on here. And you made Anna Winter smile. I mean, look at that. Oh, my There's God. There's something's going on there. probably just saying hello to somebody. Um, yeah, Luke Evans, me, Stella, and Anna Winter. Um, yeah, that was, that. I think, I can't remember who we were. Oh, I'm like, where is that boiler suit that I've got? I like that boiler suit. <laughs> anyway, I, funnily enough, I saw Luke Evans the other day at the Chelsea Flower Show, so um, we were having a good old chat. But yeah, that's and you know, Stella's my mate, so yeah, we were at we were at something, some fashion show, and I was probably with my potty mouth, and that's probably what people were laughing at because um, I was yeah. probably I was probably kind of going, nah, that's a load of rubbish. Don't worry about that. Stay but true I love to yourself. that because I, like I can that. imagine there's a lot of events like this. You're, you've got yeah, Stella McCartney, Anna Winter. You're sitting there front row, expected to I don't know behave in a certain way. You need someone there Why? who keeps it real. Keeps it real, yeah. Who yeah. well, says we have to act in a certain way? I don't way. know. Yeah, exactly. I, I wouldn't know like, what to do with myself. I'd sit there and think, I don't know. You my don't God. ever want to put me and Stella together because yeah. we will never act love in a certain that. way. I love that. All right, picture number four. Picture number four is me and my pal Thierry Henry. Um, we were making a video. Um, Thierry, we've been friends since he came to Arsenal and um, when he first came to London. Um, I was a season ticket um, holder for Arsenal and had been invited. I'd been at a fashion dinner and um, had met Patrick Vieira and he invited, didn't know I was an Arsenal fan and invited us to come to a game and, you know, and we met everybody afterwards and Thierry lived one street over from me in Belsize Park at that point. And I said, yeah, we t France is basically our biggest market. So mm. Is it? Yeah, yeah, it is. And Thierry and I got um, talking and I said, listen, if you need somebody to show you around, you know, meet a few people. 
And that, that, that was when we first became pals. And he is actually my daughter's godfather. Aww. So, yeah. It's, wow, um, what a friendship. And she's a and she's a, a, mass, a massive Arsenal fan. There so, you go. Yeah, we're a bit gutted at the moment. That's like, <laughs> we move <laughs> on. <laughs> and the final picture on our trip down memory lane. Final picture is me and uh, me, a very drunken me and quite the tipsy um, Dame Judy Dench at Brilliant. New Year. Love this story. Oh, God. We were at a dinner and um, it, was, it was New Year. It was Hug Money. And we came out the dinner and there was an automated piano playing and it was playing Waterloo by ABBA. Uh -huh. And Judy jumped on the piano. And of course, when somebody jumps on the piano, you mm -hmm. know how we go. I Absolutely. followed followed her right on. And the two of us, I mean, I'm literally like, what a little bit. I was like, I was so drunk. And um, unbeknown to us, um, somebody had filmed it. And um, the next day we were at the lunch and um, it was, my phone was in my pocket and it was on silent. It was just going, zzz, 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 zzz. Oh and I thought, God. oh my God, is there something happened at yeah. home with a, my daughter or something? So I look at my phone. My phone is just full of messages saying, "You are on TV, singing with Dame Judy Dench. It's everywhere." And my friend in Mexico City was like, "I'm looking at you on TV I right now." I love this. And I, so I go over and I show Judy, and I say, "I said, look, look, look," and she bursts out laughing, and she goes, "Good." God, if only we had no mood of prayers. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, it's the beauty and it's the danger of social media all yes, in one right there. Well, it's, do you know what? I, it was, it was, um, I think everybody saw that it wasn't a rehearsed thing yeah, and it was yeah. us just being a, oh, little, a little bit of fun. So That's it, brilliant. It, it worked all right. It was it's fun. such a great moment. Well, Charlene Spiteri, thank you for joining us on our trip down memory lane. 